This is lesson 231 in A Course in Miracles and the reading of What is Salvation? What is salvation? Salvation is a promise made by God that you would find your way to Him at last. It cannot but be kept. It guarantees that time will have an end and all the thoughts that have been born in time will end as well. God's word is given every mind which thinks that it has separate thoughts and will replace these thoughts of conflict with the thoughts of peace. The thought of peace was given to God's son the instant that his mind had thought of war. There was no need for such a thought before for peace was given without opposite, and merely was. But when the mind is split, there is a need of healing. So the thought that has the power to heal the split became a part of every fragment of the mind that still was one, but failed to recognize its oneness. Now it did not know itself, and thought its own identity was lost. Salvation is undoing in the sense that it does nothing, failing to support the world of dreams and malice. Thus it lets illusions go. By not supporting them, it merely lets them quietly go down to dust. And what they hid is now revealed, an altar to the holy name of God whereon his word is written, with the gifts of your forgiveness laid before it, and the memory of God not far behind. Let us come this day, let us come daily to this holy place, and spend a while together. Here we share our final dream. It is a dream in which there is no sorrow, for it holds a hint of all the glory given us by God. The grass is pushed through the soil, the trees are budding now, and birds have come to live within their branches. Earth is being born again in new perspective. Night has gone, and we have come together in the light. From here we give salvation to the world, for it is here salvation was received. The song of our rejoicing is the call to all the world that freedom is returned, that time is almost over, and God's Son has but an instant more to wait until his, father's, until his Father is remembered. Dreams are done, eternity has shined away the world, and only heaven now exists at all. Lesson 231 Father, I will but to remember you. Father, I will only to remember you. What can I seek for, Father, but your love? Perhaps I think I seek for something else, a something I have called by many names. Yet is your love the only thing I seek or ever sought? For there is nothing else that I could ever really want to find. Let me remember you. What else could I desire but the truth about myself?
This is your will, my brother. And you share this will with me and with the one as well who is our Father to remember him is heaven this we seek and only this is what it will be given us to find Father I will only to remember you Father, I will but to remember you. What can I seek for, Father, but your love? Perhaps I think I see, perhaps I think I seek for something else, a something I have called by many names. Yet is your love the only thing I seek or ever sought? For there is nothing else that I could ever really want to find but his love. Let me remember you. What else could I desire but the truth about myself?
This is your will, my brother. And you share this will with me. And with the one as well. And the one and with the one as well who is our father. To remember him is heaven. This we seek. And only this is what it will be given us to find. Father, I will but to remember you. recorded all the previous year apart from maybe 20 or 30 lessons which this is one of them I won't be re-recording every lesson but on patreon I'm putting the link to the daily lesson so if you would like to get the daily lesson update 
click the link below and join as a free member. Have a wonderful day. I think I'm just going to sit for a few more minutes and just rest in this space. We are home. I am home. Dreaming of exile. Our true will is given us. That's all we want.